Hey guys, Darcy here, and today we're going to talk about how you can go about saving yourself some DSP and CPU resources. Let's get into it. All right, so we're in Luna, and we can see here with this session, this is this uh, instrumental that I made, um, there is about a render of 72% down here in the bottom left. Our DSP is not really being used. This one happened to be heavily made using uh, AU instruments. Okay, so what we can do here to save some some cpu and this would work with dsp just equally as well is essentially it's pretty simple but you know not everybody maybe is utilizing this uh, is to export out stems from the individual tracks or track outs from the individual tracks and then come back and bring them in and disable everything so i have a couple of tracks here the 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 base flat wood and these two samples that are using a little bit more more plugins on, on the tracks and also the base is using the vst shape so what we're going to do here i'm going to go back to to my uh track out view i'm going to minimize this a little bit and i have already opened the finder with the the uh, files that i've exported save myself a little time so i'm going to grab these i'm going to drag these in Okay, so each of these are dragged in. Now I can relabel these like base uh, sample copy, just for simplicity here, and sample. Okay, we organize these a little bit. We're gonna drag the base up, put the samples where the other samples are. Okay, then what we would do from here, we just go ahead and route them the same way. So these two are going to the instrumental, so they're already selected. So we'll just do that, go grab uh, the flatwood base one, put that to base over here, boom. Now, the next thing we obviously wanna do is we don't want all these playing at the same time. So we're just gonna grab all the tracks we don't want anymore. We're going to mute them. And then, now this is just gonna stop them from playing, but it's not gonna save us any rendering. So what we're gonna then do is with all these tracks, we're going to, while they're selected, we're going to uh, disable all uh, on, on the plugins. So it's gonna disable all the plugins across all three of the tracks at the same time. So our renders already come down from, it was in around 70s into 49, it's gone back into the green. We're gonna go and also disable the actual uh, tape saturation because that's already been processed out as well and then with the last one we're going to just go over here and disable that uh, instrument as well so this is going to bring our rendering down by what looks to be 20 to 30 percent and obviously the more tracks you do the more you get to save and then you can still process the other tracks but you know you would obviously process them probably lighter at this point since you've already put some processing on them essentially this is just a, a way to get around doing this essential idea of freezing a track or a bounce in place for a track uh, until luna has that exact feature this is a way that i go about it whenever i I've either worked on an instrumental that I'm now mixing into a full song or a client I'm mixing has a lot going on uh, and I've kind of committed to a sound for some of the tracks and I just want to save myself resources so I could do more later. This is a way about uh, just approaching it. Commit to it, bounce it out. We uh, mute and disable everything on the original tracks. And uh, last thing I forgot to mention, while these tracks are selected, we can hide these tracks. And so now essentially we're just working with the session with all of the the process stuff but at the same time we can always go backwards uh, and bring back those original tracks if you know we've made a mistake along the way we still have that ability but we've upped our render and so we saved ourselves what we need to save ourselves Hopefully you found this helpful. If you did, let me know that uh, in the comments. Uh, if there's something I can help you with, let me know that as well and otherwise have yourself a good day. Peace.